<laughs> the Brent Crow Show. Fantastic. Okay, so this is a several segmented speech here. I generally do motivational speak speeches because I want you to take a bit of advice, try to use it, and let me know how that works out. Um, but this one's gonna be a little self-serving, but I'm gonna try to do it inspirationally, so, <laughs> right? So I'm gonna start with a question that you, I don't want you to answer right now, just think about this. Who here has a project they have started but have not finished? Okay. <laughs> Then, there, so the, the real question is, why? So, you know, you have this thing you've started. You have this idea, a crumb. You've written some things down. Maybe you've, like, penciled it in. You've started doing coloring, whatever the idea is. Maybe it's fully formed and you're just afraid to release it. It's important to finish that thing because you decided to do that project. You started this project. It came from love and a place of yourself. So it's important for you to follow along that trail and take it wherever it leads. Now, it may be your first time to do it, so it may not be any good, but just do it. Because it's that, um, that Malcolm Gladwell um, theory of 10,000 hours of a thing to become an expert at it. If you're not working on that thing, not doing that thing, you'll never become an expert at it. So with that, I've spent the last year developing a card game and it's taken a lot of my time and energy and I've put it off and I felt bad about putting it off and then I've involved some other people so they can help bring me along. Um, this really great artist, friend of mine, Ben Rose, did all the art um, and I brought it tonight. Like we were discussing earlier, there's gonna be a table in the back for playing it. Um, I got to the point where I'm ready. I put it on Kickstarter and it's doing really, really well. Um, thank you. Yeah, and like the trick with that is it's not like a pre-sale system. I'm actually helping, helping the Kickstarter people help me develop it. There's some things I still need, some input, some more cards, some uh, new art and de uh, development of the box itself. I have a copy here I'm going to show you in my pocket because for right now it fits in the pocket. It's just this little deck of cards. This is my idea of like, it's done. But then I put it out on Kickstarter and now it's going to come in a bigger box that's a sturdier box, some more cards and some, a more fleshed out rule book. And it's the great thing of, like, I started this idea. I worked hard at it, and it may not be any good because it's my first, but I'm at that point where I am ready for you guys to see it. So if you have a project you have not finished, and I'm sure you do because I have others. This isn't the only thing I do. Um, keep working at it. You know, if you're writing a book, you've did some poetry. Um, it doesn't even have to be art. Like, you're like, man, I'm going to do some arithmetic today. Just finish that arithmetic. Like really work it, whatever that thing is, get it done. Um, my first speech leads into this one, you know, it's the get out of bed, get excited and do more. That's the foundation of it. To stop wasting your time, get through it, work on this project, make it happen. Um, and then a couple weeks ago, I went and saw the Polyphonic Spree. They did the Rocky Horror show for the Halloween show. Fantastic. But then Tim DeLauder had a bit of advice he said, if you're working really hard at something and it's just frustrating you, give it the time it needs. It's going to be the best it can when it is. So take your time, but work at it. Because when it's ready, it'll just explode. It'll be the very best thing it can be as long as you continue to work at it. Don't give up on it, but give it its time. Because you have the time to do so. And then get busy. So <laughs> that was, um, I felt really great to hear him say that because I was still on the fence about this project I was working on. and. Then I launched it on Kickstarter, and it's doing pretty well. About 173% funded, which is insane, Woo! right? <laughs> so, like, so I'm there, but there's still, thanks. There's still a week left, um, and I've been thinking um, really hard about it. Like, what else do I want to do? Um, does anyone know what today is? Monday of the... Veterans Day. <laughs> that was the answer I was looking for. Veterans Day. Um, my best friend joined the Air Force five or six years ago and gave up his time to serve for us. And that just, it was really great for me. Like, I couldn't do that kind of thing. Um, it wasn't for me, but I support the troops. So part of my Kickstarter, it's doing so well, as, as it goes up, I'm adding an additional copy that I'm donating to the troops.
Yeah, I'm, I'm really excited about it. Because it's, you know, people are like, they're, they're sacrificing, and then other people go, oh, it's just their job. Their job's not what they're sacrificing. They're sacrificing time with their family. They're sacrificing the midnight premiere of Thor. You know, they're sacrificing all of that, the concerts. They didn't get to go see Polyphonic Spree. They're serving in the military. So they're, they're sacrificing all of that. So then we can come out here and do this kind of thing. Um, and, you know, my best friend's back now, so he's fine, but it's uh, really important to me. So I found that charity. It's called Give to the Troops. They have a whole tier of things they want, like shampoo. You may not believe it. They can't get that over there. So there's a whole list of things, and like the top four includes board games. So I just figured that's, I'm going to do it. I'm going to take percentage of my profits as it goes up and just donate to that troops. So I feel, feel really good about that. And thank you. <laughs> that's really. You guys are absolutely fantastic. Um, so. Again, if you're working on that unfinished project, continue to work on it. If it's in the box in the attic, get it out of the attic. Put it in front of you. Work at it and complete that project. It took me a year to get here. It gave me the idea to do all these other things. I had, you know, I had a band for a while, released a CD. Now I'm into board games. So it doesn't have to be that one thing. Just keep working at whatever it is, and then you'll eventually get there. So thank you very much for your time.